Hey guys, Apollo here, and welcome to Team Fortress 2 Commentary. Today I'm going to be talking about the new item that was added in the Love and War update for the Demo Man, which is called the Tide Turner. But before I get off into the Tide Turner gameplay, playing as the Demo Knight with the Grenade Launcher Festive Style, the Tide Turner, and the Cladier Morph for that extra 0 0.5 uh, speed. And I'm also standing still for a reason because I'm lagging because I'm in a different country on vacation, like I said before. And uh, so I'm sorry, I apologize for that. But it only happens a few times. So it's not the biggest of deals, but yeah. All right, so Tide Turn, a fantastic item, only item added for the Demo Man, and basically what it does is it gives you 25% fire damage resistance to fire and 25% explosive damage as well. Uh, like so, it's better than the Splendid Screen and the fact that the Splendid Screen gives you 20% fire and 15% explosive, but not as good as the Charge and Tide Resistance with 50% fire and 40% explosive. But the tide turner allows you to have full turning control while you're charging and when you kill someone while you're charging it will refill your charge meter to 100 percent so basically if you walk at someone and you charge them and you hit them with your fucking sword it'll, and you kill them you get your charge back so you can do that constantly i did it as well pre uh, when i was playing on uh, gold rush I did it to four people in a row and it was awesome just charge slash charge slash charge slash charge slash and you just constantly can do it if you can keep killing them uh, but sadly I didn't get that recorded because I'm an idiot so whatever um, but yeah it's great you, if you know how to charge you can easily just have your charge constantly especially I recommend using the uh, dirty Persian persuader and if you have that item uh, you, then you can just give you always it'll the Persian Persuader will increase your charge recharge rate and so then you'll basically always have your charge up and you'll be able to kill anyone and th the full turning control allows you to move your mouse like anywhere you want I do it in this in this gameplay where basically I just spin around the whole time and you can just spin and spin and the cloudier morph allows you to have 0 0.5 extra charge chargeness so you can charge further um, but I do pr prefer the Persian Persuader now, but the Cloudier Morph is also a valid choice. It's probably those two swords are the best swords for using with the Tide Turner. So the Tide Turner is an awesome weapon. And since the Tide Turner gives you full turning control while you're charging, you're able to use your grenade launcher because you don't need the Ali Wabba, Ali Wabba, Be Baba Booba, Ali Baba's Wee Booties. Um, because they, they give you 25 max health and I mean... If you want the health or you, the grenade launcher, it's it's pretty much the grenade launcher is worth it just to have it, just in case you need it against sentries or something, because the Alibaba's wee booties gives you 100% increase in turning control while you're charging, and it never really did allow you to fully charge like the tide turner. I think I don't even know if they're both the same like stat, but there's no need for the Alibaba's wee booties right now because the tide turner just gives you 100%. And before Valve nerfed it. You used to be able to just kill someone with the sword and you'd have your charge, but now it, you have to be charging and uh, slash them with the sword at the same time and get that crit damage, or else you won't get your uh, your charge fully recharged. And also, yeah, that nerf was it was kind of sad, but like, I mean, that was a bit overpowered, but it was pretty awesome. So yeah, anyways, the uh, the shield is fantastic, and you, you can just take out enemies that you need to with grenade launch. Here's the lag here. I'm just constantly standing still so yeah here I am dem demonstrating the spinning effect so you can just constantly charge I do fail at the start but the charge is crazy good how you can just control it and you can just fly up to someone and just bash them so you'll be seeing a lot of people using demo night um, throughout TF2 so anyways guys hope you guys enjoyed the video that's pretty much it for this video on the tide turner of the love and war update don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date with all of my videos i'm going to be adding on the love and war update and future videos of team fortress 2 as well hope you guys enjoyed the video thanks for watching and i'll see you all later goodbye love you